What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Double T Gaming. And actually, I've made a World of Warcraft video in a while just because I don't really, I just haven't really had the pat one, not really passion, just wanting to play it. I don't, haven't really wanted to play World of Warcraft in a long time. Uh, I just have no drive to play. I know there's still a lot going on with it. The movie just came out the other day. Uh, I think uh, Legion launches in a couple months. I think there was a big announcement about Legion on Friday. That's what I read. I didn't read, didn't bother reading the announcement. I don't really care that much. Uh, I guess Blizzard's way of trying to get you back into the game is they give you like a. Tr I kept getting emails about a transmog si shield and sword from the movie, shield and sword from the movie. Excuse me, but that's not. I don't. I don't want to talk about Legion. I don't want to talk, talk about Live WoW. I just want to talk about because my past World of Warcraft videos they've all been about uh, basically legacy servers, uh, private servers, everything that just goes back to when WoW was like good. And the pa over the past couple weeks, Mark Kern had his meeting. The Stowries had their meeting. I just kind of want to go over like what that means. So basically, there's not a definite answer about yes or no. It's going to happen. Uh, what we know so far is that Mark Kern and the Stowries both said that the Blizzard team is very passionate passionate about wanting to relaunch Vanilla Realms and everything, but they also find it they're also going to find it very difficult to do. They still have the originals. Like someone stated. I don't know who it was for a member of Blizzard said that they don't even have the original source code anymore. That turned out to be not true at all. They do have the source code for it. But a process like a process with this new system that's being used and the old system is like it will take a long time to like go back and do it. When you and I bet you a lot of people are like, well Nostarius did it. Yeah, Nostarius did it. But the way Nostarius did it is they reverse engineered it. So instead of actually getting like number for number, like this is how much hit points this one character had, they basically said, Oh well Wowhead back in the day said I think it was this number, so they were like, Alright, let's just ballpark it and do that. And they did a really good job of that, but that's not, those were not the actual hit point numbers about what that mob actually had. So say say for example say like Ragnaros had like let's say 1.2 million health on vanilla WoW live World of Warcraft is that I just said that right right yeah and then well that data got lost somewhere and they couldn't find it and a guy from the towers was like yeah when I was playing I think I think Rag had like 1.3 million and they're like okay well let's just go with that when even though that's not the case but they ballparked it very well they ballparked it very very well but once again, yeah, there's a bunch of technical aspects about the thing that releasing a server like that and the quality that Blizzard always puts into their games to make everything available to like everybody would be very difficult for them to do. But they do say they want to do it because when the Stowers had their meeting, they had the Blizzard team actually play vanilla World of Warcraft. They all did a Strathal home run and they all said they had a blast, something about like one dude's pet was level 8, didn't know he was level 8, so he wiped the whole raid like three times. Not the whole raid, the whole like three times. Um, it's just, they know, they're listening. They're they're passionate about it. They, they know what we want. They've been listening to everybody. They got the entire petition, all, whatever, however many signatures that now, I don't really know. But they are just, they know what we want, and they're listening. But the fact is that they still haven't said a definite yes or no yet. All they said is, that it will take a lot of work. I know I'm repeating myself, but that's basically what it is. Uh, but you can't just decide in one. When there's a big company like that, you can't really just decide in one meeting, like, yes, we're going to do this. No, we're not going to do this. There's a bunch of people, like, on the hierarchy that's got to go through before they can actually say yes or no. And I don't know when we'll get that answer for that. If they're ever going to do it, I feel like it would be sometime after the launch of Legion and the, all, in the content drought that every expansion has. The Luka Warlords haven't had a content patch in forever. If anything, if this was, if you rewind this whole entire like movement we're doing two years, I bet you we've already had would have already had legacy servers with after this Warlord crap fest that's been. Um, but that's basically it. So they're listening to us. They see what we want. They see that we don't like live WoW right now. I feel like they're gonna wait to see what, uh, what um. Legion has to hold. If we like Legion, I th I feel like they might put a hold in this legacy server thing until like a long time down the line. And if we don't like Legion, then maybe they'll try and speed up the process a little bit. But either way, I feel like this should happen. I feel like this needs to happen. I feel like eventually this will happen. It's just a matter of when and what kind of analytics are going to go behind it. Like, is it going to be battled on that thing? It's going to be a whole separate browser. 
all that all that stuff i mean we keep saying hey why don't you guys do this do this do this nostalgia did this yeah but nostalgia it took nostalgia like years to do that granted they were not a big company like blizzard but you know it's whatever <laughs> but i i still don't play wow anymore i don't want to play it maybe i'll play i already have legion pre-ordered when it comes out i will i'm gonna play it of course i'm gonna play it uh i'm gonna see how it is i'm gonna max out a couple characters but I really don't believe that it will be anything like it used to be. And I feel like that's the case for a lot of people. I know I'm, I'm just ranting right now. I know I had a lot of pauses in this. Uh, but, yeah, this because World of Warcraft was one of the first... It was one of the first games I ever played on this channel. And it was one of the first main games I played, like, legitimately, like, played, played. Like, hardcore played. Like, this used to be, like, my life, this game. And then... I guess, I don't know if it's me getting older or the game getting better Or, <laughs> whoops getting worse but yeah but anyway thank you guys for watching simple to gaming leave a like comment subscribe tell me what you think about all the situation and i'll see you guys in the next video